Stephanie, of all the people you've met on your journey and all the places you've been, somehow in some way, you ended up here with me. I know without a doubt the universe puts you in front of me because we were meant to spend our lives together. I will forever cherish the day you first told me you loved me because you beat me to it. The pure joy and happiness on your face when you got to touch a real elephant in Thailand and the day we got engaged because I was able to keep a secret for longer than a day. <laughs> I cannot imagine walking through this life without your gentle touch, overwhelming support, contagious joy, and everlasting love. You always know how to pick me up when I'm down, love me when I need it most, make me laugh when I'm sad, and put me in my place when I deserve it. <laughs> Best of all is when you surprise me with a hug and a kiss for no reason, other than to show me you love me. Leave me notes on the refrigerator, just so I know you're thinking of me, or ask me to sit with you while you're studying, just so we can spend some extra time together. The journey, this adventure that we're on, has already challenged us as a couple to work through hardships and obstacles and to become stronger in our communication and our commitment and to our love. Stephanie, to you I promise I will never give up on you or our marriage, to be faithful and loyal to you, to love you, to communicate with you, to laugh and to cry with you, to kiss you every night before bed, surprise you with flowers when you least expect it, and best of all, listen to your love by the outfield whenever you think it's appropriate. You are my everything, Stephanie, my love of which you hold, and my commitment to you in this marriage goes beyond death do us part. <laughs> Standing in front of you today makes me feel overwhelmingly happy. Getting to this point has taken many years, especially on your part. Before you came into my life again, I had practically given up on love. You were able to pull me from that spell of negativity by showing me a different love that I didn't know even existed until you. You showed me a new perspective of the world by taking me to new countries. You showed me the depths of your love by moving across the country to be with me. And you shared with me an equally high love for Taco Bell. <laughs> I might not have had the courage to say I love you first if it wasn't for the ambiance of that Taco Bell drive through Thank you for always supporting my dreams and being my biggest fan. I'm the best version of myself when I'm with you, because when I'm with you, I can just truly be myself. <laughs> For our future, <laughs> I promise to travel with you every year to a new place where we can create new memories and share unforgettable and hopefully not near-death experiences. <laughs> I promise to never make you eat an olive again. I promise to always love and support you in whatever business or career endeavors you decide to take. I promise to take care of you when you're sick and comfort you when UCF loses. I promise to fill any cavity you should get in the future. I promise to grow with you as a couple and to never go to bed angry. I promise to always fold the laundry after you wash it. I promise to make each place we move to feel like a home. I promise to grow old with you. And most importantly, I promise to fiercely love you until death reunites us again. I now pronounce you husband and wife. Anthony, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> Now let us welcome for the very first time as husband and wife, Anthony and Stephanie Catoni. me 
middle ground Hopes and dreams turn upside down But it's always been you Her soul is kind and pure. She's intelligent and motivated and caring. And Anthony is the counterpoint of that. He is, no, no, I mean, in, in a good way, he is the same. He is intelligent and caring and um, the most wonderful partner I could ever imagine for my sister. And I know that they're gonna have a lifetime of love and happiness and I'm very excited, as I'm sure we all are, to watch them grow and their family grow and see where this adventure takes them. But Anthony, I'm so glad that my sister is marrying somebody that I can say that I love almost as much as I love her. Yeah.